What is up you guys and welcome back to my channel. So as you can see down below by the title, I am finally giving you guys a long awaited dorm tour. This video was requested before I even got to college. So I know y'all been waiting to see this one. But before we go ahead and get into the video, I did wanna go ahead and briefly answer some of your most asked questions. So starting with the first question is gonna be, what school do you go to? I'm attending Georgia State, it's in downtown Atlanta. And the next question being, what housing am I living in? I'm currently living in University Commons with the four separate bedrooms and two shared bathrooms. The next question being, what year am I in? This is your girl's freshman year. It's giving very much freshman, very much lit, very much I just got on campus, very much I'm trying to explore my city. So I'm excited y'all, I've always wanted to come here so I'm super glad that I was able to get the chance to do that. And the most asked question is, what is my major? For my dream career, I would need to withhold a Bachelor of Science degree. To be more specific in the field of like chemistry or biology, me personally, Personally, I'm doing biology and that's really it don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below and let's go ahead and get into this dorm tour here's just an overview of what everything looks like when you first walk into my dorm so looking over to the right of me are the two bedrooms and then their shared bathroom and then moving right here we all share this kitchen table and then here is the living like den area we have like a couch right here a table in the back couch right here and then another table and then we also have these games I don't know if y'all have this but if you are in college for the girls it's such a fun game to play we also got uno it's always good to just have like you know games and that's really it for the den area we didn't really decorate it it just came as is but we do keep it really clean in here so I love that and then moving on to the freaking view I literally think we have the best view like in our whole dorm. We can literally see so much of the city, so I'm so obsessed with that. And then moving over to this window, once again, a great view of the city. Really, really nice. I also forgot to mention, you guys, um, of course the windows came with blinds, but we just love the natural lighting and the view. So we just literally keep these up like 24 seven. Like we never roll them down. Natural lighting is always the best. When you got a view like this, you don't wanna see this every day. So we always keep these up all the time and our thermostat is right there and then we have these two lights one goes up in that hallway right there with me and my roommate's room and then one obviously goes in here in the den area and i don't know about y'all but we keep our thermostat on the coldest setting um it is kind of like one of the older ones it's at 50 degrees in here so we keep our don't cold fan on high like that's how we like it and that's just that on that so yeah that's the thermostat lighting Den area, perfect view. And then once again, we got the kitchen, dining table area. So here's just an overview of our sink area. We got some soap, some hand soap, some dish soap, you know, things to clean the dishes with. And then my roommate got this water filter for the faucet, which is really, really nice and convenient. This is just what the sink area looks like. And I love that my roommates are also obsessed with the little wallflowers, but I love stuff to smell good. This one smells so good, so I'm so glad she got that one. Then we got a Keurig right here. We got our toaster. And the way we kind of did the cabinet space, like we all got a designated area to put our things. One of my roommate's things are in there. My stuff is in here. You know, we both share these two and my other roommate stuff is in here as well as these bottom cabinets. Like we all kind of share the space. And we also have a dishwasher. I think most of us prefer to just hand wash our dishes. So I don't think anyone has used it yet, but it's there if you would like to use it. And then coming back to the sink area, we have these cabinets that just have like cleaning supplies in it. And then coming along to our microwave, we have the microwave right here and then the stove area. And then we have two like hand towels right here. And then coming over here to the refrigerator area, on top we just have an air fryer, a George Foreman and a blender. And then, you know, the freezer, regular refrigerator stuff in there. And basically how we did that, we just all just shared the space, so. That is the refrigerator area. Oh, we also have this broom right here and we also have this trash can. 
so now let's go ahead and move on to the fun part and maybe get into how me and my roomie like bodied our bathroom like it looks so good we're doing like black gray and silver so i just love our like sink decorations so this is her side of the sink i'm not really gonna get into that but we have this in the middle super super pretty i'm not sure where she got this from because my roommate got this stuff but it just looks so nice. Like the tray is so pretty, the little candle. Um, obviously you can't light candles in your dorm, well at least not in my dorm. So this is like strictly for like decoration, but I just love how it looks. And then moving on to my side, I just have my vanity mirror. I'll come out here and like pull up a chair, do my makeup, do my hair. This vanity mirror, I ordered it from Amazon. I'll be sure to go ahead and link it down below. It was super inexpensive and it's super, super cute. And I feel like it comes with a lot of like settings and it's really, really cute. It is touchscreen. So you turn it on like that. And then this is the white setting. And then it also has like a more yellow tone. And then the last one is like a really, really yellow tone. So I just love how cute that is. And I got the black one. They did have a white one and a rose gold one, if I'm not mistaken, but I'll be sure to link it down below so you guys can go get it. And yeah, y'all, that's super cute, so I love that. And also on my side of the sink, I just have my favorite scent from Beck and Body Works. This is a mahogany teak wood. It's the hand soap from White Barn. I love mahogany teak wood. I get it in the wall scents, the hand soaps, the candles, like anything mahogany teak wood, baby, I'm getting it. And plus it went with my like black aesthetic, so. That's on my sink. And then you both get like lots of cabinet space. Of course, this is her side and this is my side. And my roomie also got these two gray rugs for both of our sinks. And then I just got this motion sensor trash can for us to use. And I also ordered this online as well. If I could find the link for it, I'll link it down below. And apart from our shared sinks, we have the shower and toilet area, Lights, which is right there. And then we just have some for breeze, you guys. If you don't have this scent, baby, what are you doing? It smells so good. And then you know we gotta have stuff to clean our toilet with and then some toilet paper. And then my roomie got this cute silver trash can, so that's super cute. As far as the shower curtain, I don't know if y'all can see that, but it's this like pretty silver metallic -y kind of shower curtain, super sleek and clean and pretty. And then inside the shower is all our products and stuff like that. We have this shower caddy that we both share size. And then we got this little towel assortment going on. And then as far as the rugs, we got one for the shower when you step out and then one that goes by the toilet. Really nice and I just like love how everything is always clean. It just looks and smells so good in here. So that's the vibe for the shower and the sink area and the bathroom area. And this is what she is looking like. If you've seen my TikTok, it literally blew up. So I know a lot of you guys already like seen what my dorm looks like for the most part, but y'all wanted all the details and the scoop on where I got everything from and just something more in depth. I am just so excited. Like it turned out so good. A lot of y'all were like, girl, you need to be a whole interior designer. It looks amazing. Like you did a huge transformation. So I'm just really happy that y'all loved it because I loved it. I'm a firm believer that your bedroom is your like safe place. It's your sacred place. Like something that needs to look good to make you feel good. That's just my personal preference. Like I love decorations. I love making something feel like home. And if this is not home, maybe what is? So here's an overview, y'all. I'm giving y'all an overview of everything from floor to ceiling. And we're just gonna go ahead and get into it, starting with what y'all wanna know. And I mean, everything will be linked down below in the description box on where I got these things from. Let's go ahead and get into it. So starting with this wallpaper, you guys, this wallpaper is too, die for it's so so nice it's super super detailed as you can see it's like this gray and white like charcoal marble kind of thing and i really feel like it brought out the headboard so i'm so obsessed with this and my dad did such a good job like he did amazing like do y'all see that like he literally went around that that's like art like that's a circle he literally went around that circle so Shout out to my dad for really making this so clean and pretty. So yes, the wallpaper came from Amazon. I will link it down below, so be sure to go ahead and check that description box. Okay, so moving along from the wallpaper, the sign, I had so many questions on my sign. 
The sign is from an Etsy seller. I'll be sure to put her information down below. It's super cute. They had different fonts, different colors. Um, an estimated price is $400. I don't remember the exact amount, but I know for like the minimum, it was 400 and something dollars. Her shipping was super, super quick. It literally came in like two days. It was really easy to hang up. We just used command strip. I had to get Mariah Layla. I was gonna get just Mariah, but I was like, baby, we need to get the whole brand. Like this is a brand. You know what I'm saying? Like this is my brand. So I just love this. I feel like it adds so much character and color to the room. So I had to get this. So sign from Etsy seller and then wallpaper from Amazon. Once again, these both will be linked down below. And moving along to my bedding, you guys, I had so, so many questions. When I mean so many, I had so many questions. You guys were obsessed with how I did my bed. A lot of you guys are wondering how I got it so high. So we're gonna go ahead and get all into that right now. So starting with the headboard, this headboard is such a good material. It's really sturdy, like it's super, super sturdy. And it's very, very soft. It's like velvet. And then I just love this right here. If it was plain, baby, it wouldn't be hitting. But like with this going on, it's so detailed. And then on top, I actually have like an outlet place to charge my phone. I don't really use it, but if I wanted to, the option is there. The headboard was around $200. It came from Dormify, so I'll be sure to link that down below as well. And next we're getting into the actual bedding so you guys have seen this before this throw blanket is the one I bought from home um, it came from Target I got it like last year when I was redecorating my room so check out my glam bedroom like transformation or something like that I'm pretty sure I linked it there but this throw blanket is from like a year ago so that came from Target and moving along to the pillows you guys these are pillow cases. I had to order them from Amazon. They did not come with the pillow already in them. I had to buy those. These from Ikea and these um, three right here, the two gold ones and then the one right here came from Amazon. So keep in mind that if you want to order these pillow cases, it's just a pillow case. It's not the pillow with the pillow case. So yeah, they're super, super good material. They're super thick. Um, these are 20 by 20 and then I got two 18 by 18s. And then I don't remember the measurements for this one, but I'll be sure to put it on the screen. On average, I wanna say they're about $10 a piece. So super cute, super affordable. And then I have these two back here. They came with the set, the comforter set, which is also from Target. So once again, I will be linking everything on my bedding down below. And that's really all the tea. Like, it just looks so good, y'all. Like, I still can't believe I did this good of a job. Like, it just looks so good. So, I feel like pillows really bring out your dorm. So, if you haven't had any decorative pillows, let this be a sign to go get you some because decorative pillows bring your room from a two to a 10, like, period. And now getting into this organizer, you guys, I had a lot of questions about where I got it from and what's in it, like what do I store in it? The whole entire organizer came from Target. Once again, it'll be linked down below. Now we're gonna go ahead and get into what I store inside of it. It has about 10 storage bins. And if you know, you know, storage is so important in college. And another good thing about it, it came with wheels as well, which is so convenient. And I'm super big on organizing. So in the first drawer, it's just my jewelry. These organizers came from Target, super cute. I have like my rings and my like earrings in here, my anklets, my like, necklaces, more necklaces, more anklets, and then all my silver jewelry in here, like my Pandora bracelet, got my Apple watch in here, and like other silver things. And shout out to my sister for picking these out for me. I love how it looks, it's super organized. So yeah, that's in that drawer. And then moving on to this drawer, we have just my everyday personal things that I just use every single day. I do have a lot, lot, a lot more other um, self-care products under my sink and storage under my bed. But coming into this drawer, I have my like face wash, toothpaste, my retainer, like lots of floss, Advil, like, you know, my moisturizer, deodorant, etc. Um, so that's that drawer right there. And moving on to this drawer, you guys, it's just my everyday like makeup, my beauty blenders, like lip gloss, like, you know, foundation, concealer, all the kind of stuff like that. I don't wear a lot of makeup, but I wanna get into it. So this is my little small collection that I got going on in here. And then moving on to this drawer, I have a lot of pairs of my favorite lashes. We've got some cotton rounds in here, some nose strips um, for your pores, some eyebrow razors, and like some hair glue. I have to use that for my lashes, so that's in here as well. And I have so many like packs of lashes, y'all. If you love lashes, you wanna stock up. I did a whole like beauty supply run before I came here, so I'm stocked up on like all the goods, lip gloss, lashes, just everything. And this is not even all of it. I have so much storage. Like, like under my bed under my sink so I'm all set to go on to this drawer this is just my like hair drawer I have my favorite edge control y'all go ahead and take a screenshot right now baby because this 
this is it okay this is it it's giving and then I have some more of these sections I keep like my black hair ties in here and then like my scrunchies in here a lot of these came from Target and then I have my claw clips right here these came from Amazon you know some more combs clips for my hair um, glue and like my elastic band like I said everything is organized so I don't have to go like looking for it it's just right there moving along to this door this is the door for my sunglasses y'all know I love shades so all my shades are in here and then moving on to this drawer I have like my little spa headband some makeup wipes my current favorite like body lotion and I love this product it's called quick curls so this is just like a miscellaneous kind of drawer with like random things in it. Moving on to this drawer. This is like my nail drawer. I got some press-ons for when I don't have time to get my nails done. I can just put the press-ons. I got some white gel polish. You know, like a nail filer, nail glue, nail clipper. Just your everyday like nail care necessities. So all that stuff is in this drawer right here. And then in this one, I have this um, Asteria satin bag. I just keep my bonnets and my scarves in here. So that's what this is for. And then this last drawer, I keep my wigs and these satin bags. So that's what's in that. And yes, you guys, this is what this wall is talking about. I love my accent wall. This is probably my most favorite thing about this room. The storage bin came in handy a lot, so I really would recommend getting one of those. And I'm gonna go ahead and lift this up, you guys. I pushed my dresser under my bed, and I would recommend also getting a bed skirt because you don't want all this, you know, just showing, because that is just ghetto. So <laughs> I got this black bed skirt, and it just looks really good. I'm just really obsessed with how everything looks. I keep saying that y'all because it looks so freaking good. On estimate, it was around a hundred dollars. Probably sure to go ahead and link that down below. Super inexpensive, super cute. And overall, I just really love how it just bought out the room. I wanted to get a rug with gray in it because you know, the wallpaper is gray. I have my little gray throw, my gray headboard, and I wanted to tie it all in together. That's why I got this rug. It has like gray, gold, and black in it. And then moving on to my full body mirror. This is an easel mirror. My mom got it from Target. I actually got this in store, whereas all this other stuff came from like online. Literally, I ordered everything online. But this one we bought in the store. It's just this like gold easel mirror. Love my easel mirror. This was definitely an essential for me. Like if you know me, I like my mirror pictures. I need to see what the outfit is looking like before we step out. So this does the job. It's super big, super wide. So I'm really obsessed with it. And y'all know I love my wall plugins. I have this one plugged behind the mirror just to make the room smell even better. So here's the overview of this. And beside my mirror is my closet. Here is just what the closet is looking like. So up here I have everything hanging on this over the door hook. It's just black. I got it from Target. I'm pretty sure you can like find these anywhere though, but I just got mine from Target. And y'all know I have tons of purses and bags and robes and just lots of stuff so i just hung like a majority of my purses that i wear my outfits up right here and then this is like my key card holder it has my panther card in it which is like a student card and my key to lock my bedroom and i also have my umbrella on here too that i, I haven't used yet hence while the tag is still on it it came from target if you plan on coming here not just like georgia state but at a college in general having like your rain boots your raincoat and like an umbrella is like super important especially if you come in here babe, because we do a lot of a lot of walking anyway getting into like this area my towel that i'm currently using and my robe y'all i think i left my black robe back home in virginia so i'm gonna have to have my mom like mail that to me but yeah so this is this area and then aside from my dresser that i have under my bed i have clothes hanging up in my closet all of these velvet hangers are from target so i ordered them online i think i got like five packs and they had like 30 or 20 in them and if you have a lot of clothes like your girl i would definitely recommend like the velvet hangers instead those plastic hangers are way way too bulky and i feel like with these you can get way more of your clothes packed in here because they're like super super thin and then up top i just have my shoes i know a lot of people didn't bring their shoe boxes to college with them they just kind of like stack their shoes anywhere but to me personally that's a little dirty like if i'm wearing my shoes i don't want to just keep them like on the floor lined up like no i want to put them in the boxes so that you know they're just in the boxes you know i had to send some shoes back with my mom y'all because i bought way too many shoes and way too many clothes so don't be like me and bring your whole entire closet um just some stuff that you know you're gonna wear frequently or you know for certain events 
but don't just bring a whole closet because I guarantee you, you're gonna have stuff to take back home. This is my hamper. I also got this from Target. And in this little bin right here, I just have like my sandals. These didn't come with boxes and I just have to have my shoes and something. Like I don't see how people just be having their dirty shoes on the floor. Like, no. Like keep everything in bins and like boxes to like, you know, preserve space and like make it look less cluttered. Anyway, moving on to my backpack, um, it's North Face. But yeah, I just keep it in here so that I know where it is and I don't have to go looking for it. So yeah, I keep that in here on the floor. I would really recommend getting one of these. People typically use them like for closets, like laundry rooms, etc. So I really recommend getting one of these. So moving right along, I got my little mini ironing board. This comes in handy, y'all. I cannot stand wrinkly clothes. So I definitely had to get this and my little iron right here and then I have this mini vacuum cleaner which I use almost every day like I think your girl got a little cleaning problem but we not even gonna talk about that and then moving over to one of my second favorite parts of this room um, is this little TV entertainment area this is a 43 inch TV for size reference um, and I ordered this like little cubicle situation going on. I ordered that online from Target, so I'll be sure to link it down below. Once you get to college, you'll realize like storage is important. So anywhere you can like comfortably fit your things, I would highly recommend. And y'all know my obsession with perfume. I bought a few of my favorites and then I have some going on there in the back. The trays from Amazon, I'll be sure to link it down below. And I was also getting a lot of questions about this greenery situation I got going on. I got this one from Ikea. It's super cute. It's like these little leaves. And then on this shelf, I have like a picture frame moment and some more greenery going on. The greenery is from Ikea and the picture frame is from Target. I don't have a picture in it yet. And then another plan, I love this one because it has a gold like little vase. So moving right along from like the little TV entertainment area, we have one of my other favorite things. I keep saying everything is my favorite because I really am obsessed. But this lamp is so bomb, y'all. It's a spotlight lamp. I got it from Target once again. I ordered it online, so I'll be sure to go ahead and link it down below. You can literally turn them like all different types of directions. I thought it was super neat. It already came with light bulbs as well, so I didn't have to go out my way and order those. It also has a nice touch feature. So all you have to do is just press it, it turns it off, and then it comes on one at a time as you press it, which I thought was like super, super neat, super dope. And then moving on to my favorite, favorite, favorite part of my whole entire room, my desk area. If you know me, you know I love like stationary pieces. I love desk decor. Like this was so much fun to pick out all the stuff for it. Y'all see that view? Like that's the motivation. That's what gets me wanting to do work. So I just love like the view from my desk area. I edit my YouTube videos, I do my homework, I plan. And once again, all the windows do come with blinds, but your girl loves the natural sunlight, the views. I just keep my blinds up 24 seven. Since we're already on the topic of the window, we're gonna get into the curtains and the curtain rod. So the gold curtain rod is from Target as well. And shout out to my mom for hooking me up with this curtain situation. I have um, two black panels and then I have two gold sheer ones. And she just wrapped it like this and I thought it makes the curtains look so much better, so I love that. So I got a lot of questions about this. A lot of you guys thought this was a humidifier. It's actually not. It's actually an essential oil diffuser. I ordered it from Amazon, you guys. This stuff is so strong. If you have my room smelling so good, my friends be coming over, they be like, girl, what do you be using for your room? And I'll be telling them this. And then moving over to my lamp, a lot of you guys had questions on this. I actually bought this in a store called At Home. Um, if I can find the link to it, I'll be sure to go ahead and link it down below. I love the shape of it. That's what really drew me to this. I love the curve right here and it's just really cute. This is like more matte and then this is very glossy. So I loved how that looked as well. And then moving right along to my glass whiteboard, you guys. It's really giving, it's really it. It's 100% glass. I got it from Target. Once again, link down below. Um, it has these gold accents on it and it literally just clips on and off. I just love this. like. It's just so cute. And then moving right along to this area. This came from Target. All this stuff came from Target. Having a monitor stand really, really helped as well. I love setting my computer on this. It really gives me more of a desk feel. It's all black and once again, I ordered it from Target. This whole like dorm is like literally all Target. But Target has good stuff, y'all. Don't be sleeping on Target. The desk chair came from at home as well as the 
lamp I showed you guys. And moving on to this section, once again, we can't light candles in my dorm, but I still wanted to have one on my desk, you know, for the aesthetic. And plus it matches like my color scheme black and gold so I just like to sit that right there and then moving right along once again got some more greenery and then I also got a lot of questions on this like little calendar thing this came from Target I also got it in store and on this side you have like your months on this one and then like this is like the numbers this is um a planner by day designer if you're in college or just in school in general or just like you just be living your life I feel like everybody needs a planner and me personally I really love um day designer planners they have it on Amazon too if it's not in your stores at your local Target but day designer is the way to go so yeah I'll link this down below if I can find it so you have these three drawers in the first drawer I have my iPad back here and I don't have a case for it yet so that's why it's still in there and I do have the Apple pencil which is really convenient for taking notes in college um, I use an app called good notes which has been so helpful so definitely think this is a good investment like for college um, I also have my pencil pouch once again trying to keep that gold and black aesthetic going I have a folder back there I have my two notebooks I take these to class with me every day and then moving right along I have my gratitude journal you can order it from Amazon I ordered mine from Amazon I'll put it down below in the description box and then moving right along here are my airpods I got this super cute like coach case from my outlet back at home I would definitely recommend having like airpods in college and moving along to the second drawer this is more like you know school things I have like my index cards and the index card holder in here I have some colored sticky notes and some stick and peel index cards and then this is my notebook for YouTube as y'all know I've had it in like multiple vlogs and then I have another notebook there once again the black and gold theme is here and it's giving and then this is one of the books I have to have for one of my classes just some extra pencils right here I love this brand and there's some extra dry erase markers for my dry erase board and that's what's in that drawer and then last but not least we have my tech drawer i like to call it i have my jbl charge speaker back there just some um the cord for it my computer cord and some other cords just for other things and then i have some lens wipes right here batteries and my school actually gave us this like really cute little light you put it on your phone or put it over your computer for like online classes if you have those i don't have any but you can take this out with you it's just cute you know what i'm saying cute little mini ring light and it gets really bright too so that's super cute batteries and then this is the remote for my tv and then this is the remote for my neon sign it has different settings like different speeds and stuff like that and different like brightness levels and then as far as my camera bag it's just my camera charger batteries you know sd cards and this is just my camera bag that i put my camera in so yeah i love this area this is like top two like my accent wall and my bedding is like number one obviously but then my desk area is definitely top two favorite things in this whole entire dorm i just love how it came out and that is really it for the dorm tour you guys i hope i got everything i'm pretty sure i did this is gonna be a long video but i know i wanted to know all the details and i wanted to go in depth for y'all Thank you guys for watching. Once again, if you love my dorm and want to see more college content, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. And with all that being said, I will see you guys in the next video.